All right, this week's project is a really simple one. I uh, just wanted a an exhaust fan, cooling fan for entertainment center. Got an Xbox One and a DVR, and they both tend to run pretty hot, especially the Xbox One. So uh, I've done quite a few of these over the years, different setups and everything, computer case fans, all that kind of stuff. Uh, this just seemed like a super easy solution. Um, that was very easy to replicate. There may even be something like this out there that's all in one piece, um, that's inexpensive, uh, but everything I could find, you know, it, it started to get a lot more expensive if it came with a fan and the controller, or, you know, a power supply and everything, as well as a way to control it by temperature. So what we've got here is basically just two components. Um, the fan and the power supply with a speed control. Uh, it was all one one piece for 11, I think it was $11 on Amazon. And then these temperature sensors, I actually had, it, it was a two pack and I had one left over from a previous uh, exhaust fan project. Um, and so that, I, I just looked, it was two for I think $6. For these temperatures sensors so there's several different types of these uh, this one is pretty simple it's normally open so when the temperature comes up to 40 degrees Celsius or I think that's 104 degrees Fahrenheit it will turn on um, I did this on the AC side so that uh, when this circuit is so normally open for anybody that doesn't know it just means that in its state when it's not sort of activated it's going to be no connection so it's like your switch your light switch is off once you you know meet the condition of what this needs to be which in this case is you've brought the temperature above 40 degrees Celsius it then makes the circuit so if you had something that was normally closed it would be the opposite um, so in this case it completes the circuit turns this on and turns the fan on. I was very impressed with how quiet this fan is. And probably most of what you're hearing is the refrigerator and the, and the freezer in the background. Um, but yeah, really happy with this setup so far. Obviously it's just a you know, computer fan, but uh, having it come with this adjustable power supply is really cool. And so all in, not very expensive project. I've just got some heat shrink here. This was a little jumper that I ran just to try to make the wires, you know, cut it in half and then stretch both of them out just to try to make it a little nice, nicer. So it's a really simple one this week. Uh, one last note on these, on a lot of the reviews on Amazon, folks noted it comes with this little silicone sock. Um, you want to make sure to leave that on, especially if it's going to be um, near metal objects apparently it can short out um, so you want to have that back on there I just had it off to, to try with the fire there so thanks again for watching and I hope you have a wonderful week